Good afternoon, everyone. So, some of you may remember last year's effort by me. I've been told I need to drag myself out of the gutter. <laughs> Sorry, I failed. <laughs> I finally got a new girlfriend, and I'm really rather pumped. We've been together for four weekends, and still I've not been dumped. I found her on a certain website. We hit it off straight away with perfect hands and perfect height. She's in my life to stay. Our time is great when we are alone, and I love to kiss her cheeks. No words are spoken, no scream, no phone, just the occasional squeaks. But she does have one minor failing, a fear of sharp, pointy things. Perhaps she encountered a railing or fell against some pins. But this has left her totally housebound. We never go out for dates. And should my friends ever come round, she, well, totally deflates. I've built her a house right by my bed, an old recycled shoebox. When she comes out, then it's bye-bye, Ted. She's far, far better than socks. My room is equipped with all she needs. It's more a garage-like space. Puncture repair kit for when she bleeds, and latex to fix her face. I've gaffer tape and tubs of oil, a hand pump for when she's flat. Protection she has, no use for a coil, and I don't have to buy hats. <laughs> Sorry. She never complains or wants to shop, Four plays a thing of the past. If I can puff and she doesn't pop, she don't care how long I last. <laughs> but she seems bored, so I've ordered a friend to keep her love going strong. He'll fit right in, he squeaks, he bends, an inflatable King Kong. Yay! <laughs> okay. I can run away now. Next, everyone, for you, it's Sue Harper. Hey.